Thank you. The inner turmoil behind Three. the stiff upper lip. Sorry. William, keep smiling, yeah. darling. Please. For seven years, the crown has entertained us by guessing what the British royals were really feeling. The crown, I think, is rooted very strongly in the facts, but what we don't know is what people say behind doors and what, what people think, and, and I think it takes uh, a very good dramatist to do that in a convincing way. Now, series creator Peter Morgan and his team are wrapping things up with six final episodes centered around the Queen. It's emotional, it's real, it's difficult. There's conflict, there's friendship, there's love, all the stuff that you, you want to mine for everything it's worth. But what about the life I put aside? The woman I put aside? when I became queen. The actors playing the younger generation of royals said every day was a great learning experience. Ed McVeigh recalls some advice from Dame Imelda Staunton. And she is like the definition of professionalism. And I think your job is to be brilliant from action till cut, that's your, that's your moment. So you can't be expelling unwanted energy, trying to people please, which is sort of my go-to, I think. The show's completion means all of the actors have had to vacate their royal surroundings. The set design is so astonishing. Were there ever moments where you thought, I could really live like this, or I could <laughs> never live like this? We visited a lot of stately yeah, homes. Yeah, we were in obviously. a lot of stately homes. Yeah. I could live in any of them. I wouldn't want to clean them, but I could live <laughs> in them. We're wrapping up this story by asking what souvenirs cast members wanted most to take home. Corgi. <gasps> Great answer. I think, I think you'll probably change your answer. We had these like, what are they called? Bangles. We had these bangles yeah. that we would wear all the time. Yeah, yeah, of course. And we wanted them. They didn't we give them to us, did No, we? they were they were rented. Oh, God. You know, I know. God, I only get one, and the Aston Martin, I think, must be the one. But I did try to take his cufflinks, which have got his beautiful crest on, and they stopped me, caught me red-handed, and I had to, had to give them back. So all I got in the end was a tea towel with my face on it. <laughs>